Yeah, Betts, I love this idea. The Rock and Roll Hall of Fame really came up with a smart idea. They're opening a new exhibit that celebrates Super Bowl halftime shows. Our Will Uick live there now. Will, good afternoon to you. So show us what we can expect to see when we go in to see this display. What do they have? Yeah, Jay, let me first start off with saying I'm not yelling at you, I'm yelling with you. When they call this place the Rock Hall, they're not kidding. It is rocking in here right now in the biggest show on turf exhibit. 55 years of Super Bowl halftime shows. They have everything. So you think of some of the viral moments, like Katy Perry's left shark. If you remember, that shark was the one that was out of sync back in 2015. Let's scroll over and take a look at Joey Kramer's drum, Aerosmith. This was the first time they allowed fans on the field during a Super Bowl halftime show. A very iconic moment over here, Prince's outfit when he was singing Purple Rain in the midst of a downpour of rain. They even have some of the behind the scenes stuff like straps where they mark things over to the blueprints. We got to keep walking because we don't have a lot of time over here to Bono's jacket where he had the American flag on the inside. The first Super Bowl performance after 9-11. We have Lady Gaga's costume that was shot out of a cannon and all of this saw by millions of people. The Super Bowl is the most watched television broadcast of the entire year. And more people watch the halftime show than watch the game. That's the story we tell here. And when I say 55 years, I mean it all the way up to the most recent Super Bowl halftime show. If you remember the Infinity Room from the weekend, they even have that. It's the largest artifact in the entire exhibit right here with the mirrors and all the lights. Again, this open Jay and Betsy today and goes all the way through September, really <laughs> showcasing the perfect marriage of music and football. That infinity really? mirror thing is just as nauseating <laughs> the second time as it is the first time. Don't yeah. move too Will much please. better, though, in there than the weekend. <laughs> Are you I a little tripped out? Hey, Will, I've got a question for you. When you were talking, I was, I was asking Betsy, to me, one of the most iconic and controversial moments in the history of halftime shows was the Janet Jackson famous, infamous wardrobe malfunction. Do they even address that? Because I know the league kind of pushed away that controversy. I can, I can confirm that Janet Jackson is not here today. I don't know if there's anything else. I didn't get to go all the way through it. There's a lot of different things, but I did not see anything about the Janet Jackson halftime show. Yeah, interesting. I, I wouldn't be surprised if it was left out because <laughs> that, that was kind of a black yeah. eye. The NFL didn't like that moment at all. You remember Justin Timberlake? Google it, kids, if you, if you didn't see it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Will, thanks. That's great. We love it. Thanks.